It's Saturday morning, which means one thing. Obviously, it's park run morning. So, something I want to do on this channel more is take you guys into my life, into the running, because it's something that I love and it's something that really benefits my mental health. So, I've probably been running like on and off for the past nine years. Um, when I was like 18 to 20, I was pretty fit, in shape, and then I took a back step with my mental health. Obviously went into hospital, heavily dosed up on medication, put on loads of weight, and then went more into like weightlifting, bodybuilding, cardio, took a back step. But then as COVID came around, I started to run as most people did in the lockdowns, and slowly get myself back to now where I'd say, I'm probably potentially in the best shape of my life, but definitely the fittest I've ever been in terms of cardio. My Garmin tells me my VO2 max is 55, which is like, I think one step off. If it was 56, that would put me into elite of VO2 max. So maybe the part run that I'm gonna do this morning, which may be a PB, it will tell the Garmin that yes, I'm fit enough to go into that mode or into that zone. So, Yes, I may get a GoPro to take you guys into the runs with me so you can see what I do. I do um, sort of distances between 5k and half marathon generally. I've got a race next month which is a half marathon. I have done one full marathon, it's been a bloody brutal. Time for that was 4 hours 13. To give you an overview on times, my 5k PB is 19 minutes 50 seconds. So I'm gonna go for a new PB today and I'll let you know what that is. But like I say, it really benefits my mental health for a number of reasons. Probably the first and most important, it means having some goals in mind in terms of that being time or feeling a certain, or like physically in a certain condition, means that throughout the week, every little decision I make, whether that be good choice of food, um, like not drinking caffeinated drinks so I sleep better in the evening, um, relaxation, recovery, so like the foam rolling stuff, the stretching, it keeps me on track and it keeps me disciplined because there's that goal in mind. And I think if I don't do those things, I'm not gonna be progressing. So naturally, it works well. Um, so that's the first reason, it's, it's the discipline, gives me something to work towards, obviously health and fitness benefits. Probably, maybe more so, is that it gives me, it puts me into a sense of community. I've got a great, my best mate is my running partner, which is amazing. We go out probably three, four times a week. It's that social aspect, we have a laugh, we have fun. But also on park run on a Saturday morning. So even if I was to go on my own, like this morning, unfortunately you can't make it. But turning up, there's a crowd of people there at my local park run in Chelmsford. There's usually between 500, recently the past few weeks, there's been 800 people turn up. Everyone's in high spirits. Everyone's turned up on a Saturday morning, starting the weekend, feeling like in the right positive attitude. So even if they've gone out drinking before, which they probably haven't because they'd be hungover, they're like, right, let's freshen up, let's do this early, waking up, so no lay-ins, yeah. We're just starting the weekend in the right mindset. Just got in, pleased to say, I think it was a park run PB, so we'll see when the results come through later. We did it in another route, so my watch was clocking 5.06. You go on the grass three times. Uh, I've got 19.45, I think my park run PB before that was 19.50. Gave everything, went all out. I actually crossed the line feeling like dizzy and a bit of faint. Um, it was a different route. So you go, we go up a hill once and then through grass actually three times. So I feel like if I put that effort in at that pace on a track, it would be a lot quicker. Maybe like, I don't know, 1935. We'll see. I am also in the process of buying some carbon shoes. I always wear Ultra. I've got wide... Um, feet and I always like the toe shape, toe box shaped shoes. So I usually wear the Via Olympus 2. I turned my Via Olympus 1 into trail shoes. Swear by Ultra, for me they're like the perfect shoe, they're zero drop, 
I've never used a carbon shoe, but I'm trying to get that a little bit quicker on the 5Ks and half marathon, half marathon time as well, which I've got next month. So just to let you know, and with a first video, 5K PB 1945, 10K PB 4315, half marathon PB, I think it was 139, I don't know, can't remember. And I've done one marathon and that was four hours 13. So setting a foundation here at the first video. Yes, there we go. Any of you out there that haven't tried running before, I definitely recommend it. Just it releases endorphins, it makes you feel good and it's fun. Start slow, start off walking, but yeah, I really enjoy it. So I'm going to document it as I go through. And just on that, if you pause the video now, multitask over to Strava, give me a follow and give me kudos on all of my upcoming runs. That'd be sick. Bye.